in technology enhanced learning. Technology should support and serve learning rather than drive the learning experience. It needs to be integrated into educational processes to achieve learning aims and outcomes. Add value includes it allows students to explore educational content both in line with their own interests and at their own pace. Also share of resources via interment platform and internet learning object and accelerate student-centered and project-based teaching practices. So, technology should support learning. Technology enhanced learning needs to be integrated into educational processes. It allows students to explore educational content in their own interests and pace, plus share of resources via Internet Learning Object. Methodology or approach for application e-learning web 2 tools as facebook twitter or use blogs or wikis mobile devices and apps and simulation including mannequins case scenarios and computerized environments in addition mocks web 3 virtual academy and classrooms learning management systems as blackboard and moodle also a learning object repository is an online library for storing managing, and sharing your learning resources, learning objects, as Merlet repository. You should organize, monitor, and evaluate. Monitoring can be described as tracking learners, activities and outcomes. Either self-monitoring or learners can be monitored by another person, usually by a teacher or an administrator. Monitoring can be activity-centered, process, or outcome-centered, product. What about evaluation? Correct we could use. Learning analytics. Educational data mining. Awareness and reflection. In technology-enhanced learning. So what about holistic evaluation model, which is four-level model? Holistic TEL evaluation model. A four-level model. Level 0, preliminary evaluation of the need. Derived from, module evaluation, student feedback, assessment scores and staff identified need. Level 1. Level 1A, learner satisfaction. Derived from, Likert scale based questionnaires. And focus groups measuring, level of satisfaction with resources. Level 1B, learner gain. Derived from, pretest and post test measures. Level 2, Learner Impact. Derived from, Likert Scale Questionnaire, Focus Group. Usage Metrics and Assessment Data. Level 3, Institutional Impact. Derived from, Return on Investment Analysis. Our Best Wishes.